Now that we've discussed sharing in detail, let's get into one of the most useful collaboration tools in Onshape, comments. Comments provide an easy way to communicate with those shared in the document. So if you are looking for a way to communicate with your team members, your suppliers, maybe vendors, comments are the tool to use. Another example of using comments would be design reviews, where feedback about the design is critical. So let's take a look. Creating a comment is simple. In a part studio or assembly, click the comments icon in the documents toolbar. The comment flyout appears where you can type in a comment and then click add. Once you've added a comment, there are a few ways that those in the document are notified. First, anyone else with at least view and comment permissions in the document sees a notification of a new comment on the comment icon in the document toolbar. This gives a visual cue that new comments have been created in the document, but there is also the option to receive email notifications. This is great if you're not currently in the document but want to be notified when a new comment is added. You can also adjust your global notification preferences in the account settings for both email notifications and mobile notifications. So what if you wanted to tag a feature or a face or a part, for example, with a comment? You can do this by selecting the tag icon in a comment thread or right-clicking on an entity. Simply click on a tag icon in the comment thread or select an entity in the graphics or list, or right-click the entity that you want to comment on and select Add Comment. This allows you to add a comment and tag certain things with that comment. For example, here I want to ask if the diameter of this hole is correct, so I will right-click the hole in the graphics and choose to add a comment. You can see this face is tagged with a comment, and you can even see a small comment icon in the graphics next to that face. This makes it clear to others in the document what it is that you are talking about. In fact, when others view your comment, they can click the link just below the comment, and the geometry highlights and they are taken to the exact same position and orientation that the comment was created in. So you are not only seeing their comment and whatever it's tagged with, but you are also looking at the model the exact same way they were when the comment was created. So we've discussed creating comments and tagging different things with comments in Onshape. But what about tagging people with a comment? If you want to tag a person with your comment, simply type the at symbol and then their name or email in the comment. As you are typing, Onshape automatically starts showing you names that match of people you've shared with in the past. When a person has been tagged with a comment like in our example, they receive an email with the comment and a link to the document. We will cover assigning tasks in a future video. One last thing to mention, if the person or people you are tagging with a comment do not have permissions to the document, a dialog displays telling you the permissions are missing. You can click the button Share with Mentioned Users, and the person or people you have tagged in the comment are given view and comment permissions to that document. This allows them to view the document and reply to your comment.